Comics fans rejoice, this episode is sponsored by Fandome. DC's Fandome is an unprecedented 24-hour, truly immersive global virtual fan experience. Best of all, there's no lines and no badges required. It's free. Expect to see new things about upcoming movies like The Suicide Squad and Wonder Woman 84. Seriously, we could all use that movie about now, right? I know I'm excited for it. DC Fandom will be on August 22nd, starting at 10 a.m. Pacific time and accessible globally at www.dcfandom.com. Welcome to a world where the supernatural is natural, where more than 80% of the population possesses superhuman abilities known as quirks. And because everyone loves to game a system, there's a superhero leaderboard. At the very top of it stands the ultimate hero, All Might. All Might's feats and reputation were incredible, a true symbol of peace for everyone. That is, everyone except the hero perpetually stuck at rank number two. That's Endeavor, and he vowed to surpass All Might, but his literal firepower was just never enough. But if he couldn't do it himself, he would vicariously through his own heir. Thus, he made the desperate decision to arrange a quirk marriage. Basically, he paid a family off to get a wife with an ice quirk and popped out kids until he got the right quirk combo. Gross, I feel like I need a shower. After four, uh, attempts, they finally spawned the child he was looking for. Shoto Todoroki. Half cold, half hot. Literally, right side's ice like his mom, and left side's fire like his dad. Endeavor quickly separated young Todoroki from his supposedly lesser siblings, ruthlessly training him to become the most powerful hero in history. Surprise! Things didn't go so well. He drove Shoto's mom totally insane until she broke. Pouring boiling water on her son's left side because it reminded her too much of him. Okay, this is getting super heavy for a colorful cartoon about superpowers and frog people. Fortunately, Todoroki never truly fell for his father's disgusting manipulation. He attended UA High School, a hero academy, and worked to use his power for good. But just his mom's power. Why use fire when you can stick it to the man? The man being a big scary fire dad over there. Anyone else notice his facial hair is made of fire? How's that work? From his right side, Todoroki can summon intense bouts of cold, freezing the air or even creating massive glaciers of ice. Talk about overkill! And like a good edgy teen, Shoto named this super iceberg something badass. Heaven Piercing Ice Wall! Oh, you can just taste the self-loathing. He can create sheets of ice to slide on or propel himself forward as if riding a Healy. While he can't manipulate the ice after he's launched it, he has extremely precise control over its initial release. He can even freeze opponents so thoroughly that they are frozen both inside and out, effortlessly causing necrosis and shattering body parts. Talk about ice cold! Seriously, that's so dark! It's chilling. Save the puns for later, Boomstick. This is serious. Oh, what are you going to do? Give me the cold shoulder? Freeze this preview here and then... Sounds ice to me. Join us next week for the full battle between Prince Zuko and Shoto Todoroki. <laughs>